All right, a new children's book is out with the inspiring message that celebrates who we are by looking at family roots and ancestry. The book, Who Are Your People, was written by former South Carolina House representative, lawyer, and now political analyst, Bakari Sellers, who is joining us live to share more about his debut children's book. Bakari, uh, you hit it out of the park with this first one. It's a beautiful book. Thank you so much. I mean, uh, we wanted to make sure that we had, you know, robust imagery. We told a great story and we taught people where we come from and how to dream big dreams. And so thank you for having me just to be able to share uh, this journey with my first children's book. What was your inspiration behind writing this book? Uh, that, that's easy. It's the little boy and girl you see on the cover. Uh, that's Sadie and Stokely. They are my three year old. Uh, twins. And the reason that you don't hear them in the background is because their mother has them upstairs watching movies <laughs> and watching the room with toys. Otherwise, they would be here in my lap. They like the camera. I don't know where they got that from. But Sadie and Stokely, <laughs> I wanted them to be able to see themselves in the images. I was tired of them seeing blue and purple people um, changing the world. I wanted them to be able to see themselves and understand where they come from. And maybe their classmates who don't look like them pick it up and gain some understanding and, mm -hmm. and some empathy. And, and I, I firmly believe we have more uh, that brings us together than tears us apart. And hopefully this book is a part of a healing journey, not just for uh, black folk, but for this country. Well, Bakari, I actually read it with my four month old daughter last night, who is biracial. Her father is black. And as a white mom, I was nervous about how do I encourage her to learn her history and know where she's from, who are her people? And we were going through it, pointing out the people and like talking about it. It was such a helpful tool for me to be able to relate to her in that way. Well, first of all, thank you for that that encouragement, that endorsement. Also, I know you're not sleeping much, so I think that everybody <laughs> needs to give you a little bit That's of grace. Because a four month old, you ain't sleeping at all. But <laughs> this book was written uh, for this moment where we're having these conversations about race and um, people are having difficult conversations. This is just a tool to help you, to teach you, to learn. You learn, and when you look at the pictures and the images, to talk about how great these individuals were, mm -hmm. so that your kid can know that they too can be great. I think that we live in a culture of low expectation and hopefully this book uh, helps you set very, very high expectations for your young people. Cause we all know that if we set a high expectations for young people, they usually exceed those expectations, shock us and change the world. Yeah. Well, congratulations to Bakari. Mm -hmm. The illustrations by Reggie Brown are just stunning. I mean, it's they truly are. amazing. A perfect book for all families to gather. Thank you for sharing this story with us. Thank you, and God bless you and your sleep habits. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Bakari. Don't forget, you can always get his book, Who Are Your People, everywhere that books are sold. We're going to add it in our repertoire. It is, week. and I mean, like I said, the illustrations are just stunning, and it's. It, yeah. I think it's good for everybody to kind of get that reminder. Yes, right? oh, it, his writing oh, is impeccable in it as well. Beautiful. It's very uplifting and positive and motivating. So, oh, I love that for his debut children's novel. Incredible. I know it's novel pretty awesome. Book. <laughs> well, I'm glad that you get to share it with Amara. Yes, she gets yeah. to learn about her history. And